on how to, second episode, wing it. The first episode was how to blend it. This time is how to wing it. So we're gonna be, I'm gonna be showing you today how to wing it. I know that was very hard for me in the beginning, um, but once you practice, 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 uh, you will be a master at winging your eyeliner. And winging it is so good, you will cut people not literal it's a joke guys just a joke um but we're gonna be using suva um hydro liner in the color grease and this is water activated it's supposed to be matte and it's a hydro it's a cake liner so this is what i've been using i don't have a liquid pen i ran out of my ride or die one that's from um kat von d so I already have a little bit, it's a little bit of water already in the little cap. And we're gonna dip this Royal and Line Nickel brush. It's a very fine brush. I don't know if you could, if you can really see. See? So it's a very fine brush and we're gonna use that to wing it. So we're gonna pick up some water, swish it around in the cake. For the liner get it the way we want it to get it and when we get it the way we want to we're gonna i'm going to go in on lining it okay in this method you can use this for liner liquid liner pen liner gel liner whatever whatever way but if you see where your water line is at we're gonna start i start from the outside working my way in I'm gonna draw a little line right here where my water line is at. And I hold my breath. Drag that out. See how we have that line right there? And then we're gonna connect it. Down to the bottom. And then we're gonna, once you like the way it is, you could leave it alone or add a little bit more. You see? And then I'm gonna pick up a little bit more. And we're just gonna drag it on in to the corner. I don't usually go all the way, you can, or if you wanna stop here, if you wanna stop here, you gotta make the line a little smaller, like thinner. And I go not super fast. I usually take my time with it. Just um, tight lining it. See, so it's not really bad. I think I'm gonna stop right here. Yeah. So you see, now we're gonna move on to the other side. And guys, I usually don't put my makeup on first when I do this because sometimes if you make like a boo-boo on the side, you could take, um, I'll show you right now. You could take um, any, this one's from Bioderma, but it's like a micellar water and you could take it on a cotton swab and just clean up any mistakes you might have made. 
So now we're gonna take it to the other side, same method. We're gonna go with our waterline. And then we made our line, and then we're gonna connect it to the rest of our eyelid. Sorry if I'm not talking because I literally hold my breath and pray that it comes out good. Because sometimes Liner in the beginning, Liner used to be friends with me or could be my enemy sometimes. But if you want to get it, you get it. You just have to keep practicing. Because that's why I, always, I even tell my kids that like, if you want to learn something, you have to practice it. If you don't practice it, how are you going to learn it? So you're not going to learn how to wing your eyes the very first try. You have to try it a couple of times. This is just a method that's easy for me. Or you could use the um, shadow guard in the beginning just to get, you know, practicing on how to wing it, how to connect everything. And then I say you should take it. I say the training wheels right off and keep practicing. And then you look to see the kind of, I'm going to be honest with you, there's always one wing better than the other. Don't ask me why, it just happens sometimes. So yep, we're gonna leave it like that. So guys, this is how it is. Very easy, very simple. Okay. So I'll be right back. I'm gonna go off camera to do the rest of my look and I'm gonna come right back. Here is the final product. Something very simple, easy, and just to get an overview, um, we did a how to wing it edition using, let me see if I can find her. Uh, I'll take the top off. So using Silver Beauty um, Hydro Liner in Grease. It was this little cake thing. Um, and then we also used the Royal Royal Line Nickel Brush. This is actually a paint brush, but I use it for eyeliner. I like this a lot. Um, and then for the rest of my look, I already had did my eyes using um, I'll show you right now. Violet Rose Pro. Let me open it up for you really quick to show you. I really use just um, Nicole and Josie, those colors here. And if you have not have this palette, you should have this in your collection. It's the, if you just need one, this one will be it. Um, and then after that, I curled my lashes, use um, Benefit Big Bang Mini um, Mascara. And then after that, I did my bronzing. I'm not gonna go too much into it, but yeah, so this is what I did. 
I hope this was very helpful for you. Um, practice it. And if you don't get it the first time, that's okay. Keep trying, keep trying, keep practicing, keep practicing. Um, make sure you have um, micellar water, cut and swab. So if you need to clean up any mistakes, you can clean it up. Um, I suggest practicing before going out first, you know, without none of this eyeshadow. Just practice it first, keep practicing until you get a hang of it. So I hope it was helpful for you. And remember guys, be creative. The makeup don't make you. You make the makeup. Bye guys.